Hot Wheels Unleashed is undoubtedly one of the best kart races ever made. Its excellent controls provide tense experiences, followed by a wave of relief when you narrowly cinch a victory. It offers a bevy of content, including customizing your cars and building your own tracks, and it looks absolutely stunning, with ray tracing giving the CG rendered vehicles a tactile feeling. If you like a kart racer, you will absolutely love this game. Hot Wheels Unleashed's main mode offers an incredibly loose story that sets you off on a quest to save the city. Basically, this just involves you participating in races or time trials to open up new events on the board. Each event is a different track set in one of a half dozen or so different locations, sometimes using elements of the space to play a role in the course itself. And yes, the game also features a few novelty elements, such as starting the race in the mouth of a giant T-Rex, that feel authentic to the toys of your childhood, although I wish these were more frequently implemented. The game's controls are excellent, with the drifting mechanic, which is the key to any victory, as successful drifts fill your boost meter, feeling like a great middle ground between something like Mario Kart 8 and an arcade racer like Forza Horizon 4. I played the enemy AI on normal difficulty, and I was pleasantly surprised at how balanced the experience felt. I knew I could win every event I started, but it also took my entire focus, with one wrong move spelling disaster. I never, ever ran away with first place. It was always a nail-biter. The mechanics of each race, such as pads that give you a boost or jumps that require you to precisely control your car as it soars through the air, may seem pretty basic, but the game executes them so perfectly that even the generic roadblocks that bring your car to a halt if you run into them seem like genius game design. There are also incredible boss races, which require a first-placed finish to beat rather than a simple podium win, that are much more vast than regular events, implementing unique track stylings that are a delight to uncover. Each car also handles very differently, including the way that they implement boosting. So when you open up a blind box with another car, it's not just an aesthetic difference. And if you don't like how a certain car performs or looks, you can scrap it for more in-game currency to purchase a new blind box, or for parts to upgrade your other vehicles. The frequency with which you are awarded new blind boxes and the generous resources you are given in return for scrapping a car make it feel like you're never cheated out of acquiring new vehicles or upgrading existing ones. The game also features a litany of customization options. You can take any of the cars you acquire and customize the materials they're made out of, the paint job, and any stickers you want to attach. You can also build your own tracks with a very easy to understand track builder. I had my first course constructed within a matter of minutes. These designs, both for your car and your tracks, can then be shared with the world with you able to access other people's work, offering a near infinite amount of vehicles to drive and courses to race on. I also cannot talk enough about how gorgeous the game is. The plastic tracks and toy vehicles are brought to life via ray tracing. It truly does feel like you are racing on a real, physical track with a toy you bought off of the shelf. Like how my recent experience with Kenna Bridget Spirits made me long for a 4K ray traced Zelda game Hot Wheels Unleashed made me realize what a flat experience Mario Kart 8 can be at times. The PS5's DualSense, with haptic feedback, adaptive triggers, and built-in speaker, helped bridge the gap further between the experience on screen and the controller in my hands. Hot Wheels Unleashed is an absolute masterclass kart racer. It puts on screen what you imagined the races you had with your toys would look like when you were playing with them as a kid. The customization and multiplayer options will also make sure that players keep returning to this fantastic game. I'm sorry, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, and I say this as a huge fan of that game, but there is a new Drift King in town.